In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. Now, the Bible was not originally written in the English language, as shocking as that sounds. But it was written in the Hebrew language, and in the Hebrew language, the word for God in this first verse of the Bible looks something like this. If you were to spell it in English, it would look something like this, and it's pronounced Elohim. Let me hear you say Elohim. Elohim. In the beginning, Elohim created the heavens and the earth. Now, the word for create is the word bara. Let me hear you say bara. It's this forceful, energetic word of making things out of nothing. In the beginning, Elohim barad, the heavens and the earth. Now, the earth was formless and void. The Hebrew phrase is tohu vavohu, which gives me great pleasure to say. Some translate it wild and waste. The spirit of God was hovering over the waters. This Elohim has some sort of spirit. And then God spoke and said, let there be light, and there was light. God saw that the light was good and separated the light from the dark. The light was called day, the dark was called night, and it was evening and morning the first day. So God speaks some sort of word and makes Things. In verse 1, this God is some sort of creator. In verse 2, this God is some sort of spirit. And in verse 3, this God is some sort of word. This God is one, and yet God, this God is several. This is some, God is some sort of multiple persons, some sort of community of creativity. What a strange way to begin a very, very long book. Now, uh, 